IUCN has been involved with sea turtles for a long time, uh, from work on the beaches of Karachi to now with our Mangroves for the Future program, working along the beaches of Asia. Turtles themselves are a fairly endangered species. The main threat, however, on sea turtles, apart from the occasional poaching or the use of the turtle eggs uh, by local communities, etc., is the entrapment of the turtles in fishing nets. And so much of our focus now has been not just on the conservation of the turtles along the beaches, although that's always very important, but also on addressing that key issue. Unfortunately, there is a way to address it through something called a turtle excluder device that can be placed on fishing nets and which, if properly used, effectively allows the fishing to take place and the turtle to be flipped out of the net rather than it being caught within the net. Pakistan is one of those countries and we're working in Pakistan on a project that specifically is working with fishing communities to ensure that the TED is put onto the boats and assists with the conservation of the sea turtles. The fishing communities usually need to be convinced because there's a deep-seated fear in most fishermen that anything that you put onto a net restricts the fish catch. So it has to be demonstrated to them and it has been demonstrated scientifically in a number of studies. The whole hair, you don't want it to come loose. You want it to be soft. Remember we have to have 71 inches between here to there. So this webbing will stretch to 71 inches. Okay? That's why we did that. Size is good. The overlap is good. And it will seal very good. But turtles will be able to get out easily. Actually the TED enhances the quality of the catch because it keeps out the animals and the fish of the ocean that not fish so much but animals certainly that they don't want to get in. So it also you know flips out sea turtles but it also flips out things like dolphins etc. And so the quality of the catch actually gets better. So inevitably there is a question of training, a question of education, a question of demonstration and when all that takes place then you do end up with far better results. Traditionally a nesting beach, presumably for centuries, along the coasts, not just Sandspit and Hawke's Bay, but also along the Balochistan coast, Gwadar, Jiwani, etc. So it's a very important resident turtle beach and nesting beach. The turtles that have been tagged have been found away from far away as Oman, from Sri Lanka, and they go up and down the coasts, you know, uh, they are migratory animals, but they do come back to lay their eggs on the beach they were born on. Legislatively, uh, the trade in turtle meat, turtle shell, turtle bone has almost completely been uh, banned around the world because they are so endangered. पूरी दुनिया में जो है मैरिन की जो स्पीशीज है मैरिन की जो इकसाम है समुद्री कछुओं की वो सात किस्म के हैं ऐसे कछुए जो समंदर में रहते हैं वो अपनी गर्दन अपने शेल के अंदर लेके नहीं जा सकते तो ये जो अगर कभी भी आप लोग देखें ऐसा कछुआ जो कि अपनी गर्दन अपने शेल के अंदर लेके नहीं जा सकता उसे आपने क्या करना है समंदर में छोड़ना है इट्स एन इम्पॉर्टेंट एनिमल इट्स नॉट जस्ट इन टर्म्स ऑफ इट्स इंट्रेंसिक बायोलॉजिकल वैल्यू but also in terms of the fact that it is a major contributor to the health of the oceans. It's, uh, it's part of the circle of life in terms of sustaining the oceans, in terms of the fishing, in terms of sea grasses, in terms of um, the food chains, and so on and so forth. So, you know, like, like most forms of life, it has a place. And for IUCN, it, our role is to make, try and ensure that that space and that place for all forms of life is conserved. Our Ambassadors Fund supports small-scale, high-impact projects to improve communities across Pakistan. The Fund's priority areas are wildlife conservation, women's issues, cultural preservation, entrepreneurship, clean water, sanitation, and hygiene. Our partner, the International Union for Conservation of Nature, 
is working to increase awareness of the threats to sea turtles through its Saving the Endangered Sea Turtles in Coastal Areas of Pakistan project. Hundreds of turtles are entangled in fishing nets every year, and many have been mortally wounded. This project seeks to prevent these needless deaths by providing turtle excluder devices for 100 fishing boats. Additionally, through educational outreach to hundreds of school children, we have highlighted the threat to marine wildlife to future leaders of Pakistan's coastal fishing communities. Congratulations to IUCN for making great strides in the protection of the sea turtle population of Pakistan.